Sedation is offered by dentists all over the world to help patients relax while getting the care they need in an anxiety-free environment. Fear of the dentist is very common, so nervous patients are a fact of life for most dentists. Because dental anxiety is a constant, sedation dentistry has become more mainstream. Many dentists now offer sedation and other soothing treatments, such as painless injections, to make your visits as pleasant as possible. A calmer patient increases the likelihood of a favorable dental outcome, while the overall experience is more pleasant for both patient and staff. Sedation dentistry uses medication to help patients relax during dental procedures. There are three different levels of sedation, light, mild to moderate, and deep, and each sedation level uses different methods. The first level is light sedation. Light sedation is nitrous oxide, also known as laughing gas. It's inhaled through a mask and allows you to relax while fully conscious. After the procedure is complete, the flow of nitrous oxide is usually changed to pure oxygen for several minutes. This helps the laughing gas effects to wear off sooner so the patient can drive home safely. The second sedation level is mild to moderate, which uses either oral or IV sedation. If oral sedation is used, the patient takes a prescription pill about an hour before the procedure. IV sedation at the mild to moderate level means the same medication is received but intravenously. Patients cannot drive themselves to and from appointments when this level of sedation is used. Deep sedation means general anesthesia is used. It is typically reserved for oral surgeries as it renders the patient either partially or fully unconscious during the procedure. When patients receive deep sedation for a dental procedure, they cannot drive themselves to or from this appointment. The dentist will not perform the procedure at this level of sedation without a confirmed driver for the patient. It makes sense that dental anxiety spills over into fear of sedation, but practicing sedation dentists meet continued education and certification requirements before use of sedation on patients. Dentists review your complete medical history, including allergies, before administering sedation. If you are required to prepare in any way, you will receive detailed instructions on how to do so for your safety. Once you're cleared for surgery and receiving sedation, your vital signs will be monitored throughout the process. Your sedation dentist is trained to respond to any adverse reaction. While sedation dentistry is known for helping the most fearful of patients, it can benefit people with a range of other sensitivities or conditions that might make getting the care they need a little more challenging. Difficulty getting numb, sensitive gag reflex, fear of needles and shots, discomfort about the condition of your teeth, dislike the noises, smells, and tastes associated with dental offices, very sensitive teeth and gums, past traumatic dental experience. We want to help you be comfortable at the dentist. We're ready to work with you to make it easier for you to achieve optimal oral health. If you have questions about sedation dentistry or would like to schedule an appointment, just call us today. We can give you back the healthy, beautiful smile that's been there all along.